First, the Russia's fifth generation T-50 fighter jet has successfully completed its first test flight, heralding a new era for the country's air force. Kept under wraps up until now, its appearance was revealed by the plane's manufacturer, Suhoi, which released footage of the flight. RT's Metreza reports. Russia's hopes for the country's newest fighter jet took off with the maiden flight of the Sukhoi T-50. This is the world's first look at the latest advances in stealth technology and both air-to-air -air and air-to-ground weapons. In Russia and the USA, there's a tendency to divide military jets into generations. Every new generation differs in the revolutionary change of a number of tactical and technological parameters and combat capacities. Comparing this fifth-generation jet to its younger brothers is like comparing a Maserati to a Honda. It's a massive breakthrough in technology. Most significant are its stealth and its ability to stay at supersonic speeds for the entire duration of the flight. This gives a number of tactical advantages. For example, if you penetrate a thick anti-air defense area, you are fast on the one hand and hard to see on the other. Thus, the survival rate is increased. The United States is the only country with a fifth-generation jet currently in service, the Lockheed-built F-22 Raptor. Lockheed's next fifth-generation jet will be ready in several years. China also plans to unveil a cutting-edge fighter of its own within the next decade. The Sukhoi is slated to be available for countries to buy between the year 2015 and 2017 and expected to be sold for about $100 million apiece. India is on track to add up to 250 of the jets to its air force. Some countries will buy it uh, uh, for economical reasons because Russian fifth generation would be much cheaper than the United States. The jet being a cornerstone of Russian military hardware, experts also say the T-50 can show the world the country's technological potential. That's why it's so important to show that we are able to innovate, that uh, we are able to produce something outstanding. With twice the range of its U.S. counterpart, analysts predict the new Sukhoi could capture up to a third of the market when it comes into service in the next three years. Matt Treza, RT, Moscow.